Friends? Friends? We've only gone out together three times, and already you're telling me you just want to be friends? You never gave me a chance, and for that, you'll fry like a pork sausage. Not that I don't like you, it's just that, well, you're too nice a guy, I guess. I think I'd rather go out with someone more of it unpredictable. Hello. This doesn't look like the Lincoln Tunnel, Sam. Looks to me like a marginally volatile hostage situation, Max. Ooh, does this mean we get to kick some puffy white mad scientist butt? Can't think of a reason not to. You'll be of no use, freelance police. With the flip of a lever, my ungrateful lunch date will be reduced to a half cup of disoriented atomic matter. I knew he wasn't a real doctor. Uh, shall I confront, subdue, and pummel the suspected perpetrator, Sam? Sick him up, little buddy. Ooh! Ow! Hey, nice one. Yikes! Huh? He's not a real guy, Sam. Can I keep his head for a souvenir? Why do you suppose it's ticking? That's no head, Max. It's one damned ugly time bomb. Let's leave this criminal cesspool pronto. Good idea, Sam. Maybe we can ditch the head somewhere while the credits are running. You mind if I drive? Not if you don't mind me clawing at the dash and shrieking like a cheerleader. Sam, is pronto a real word? Goodbye, Sam and Max. I'll never forget all you've done here today. That was a pleasantly understated credit sequence. I enjoyed the cheesy retro ambiance. What the hell are you talking about, Max? Sam, either termites are burrowing through my skull, or one of us is ticking. Oops. Oh, yeah. Max, where should I put this so it doesn't hurt anyone we know or care about? Out the window, Sam. There's nothing but strangers out there. I hope there was nobody on that bus. Nobody we know, at least. Hello?
Hello? Yes? 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 No! Really? Well, the same to you, Mac. Another confused census taker? Actually, it was the commissioner with another idiotic and baffling assignment. Does it involve wanton destruction? We can only hope. Due to the arbitrarily sensitive nature of the mission, we'll be meeting a bonded city courier out on the street. Ooh, smells like a fiercely thickening plot. This phone represents unhindered contact with the outside world. Until they realize we don't pay the bills. I can't use these things together. It's Max. It's Max. without it. Yeah, we may need it to bribe slippery government officials. I can't use these things together. It's Max. I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. I can't pick that up. I can't talk to that. Joe, you want a piece of me, huh? Well, take a piece of this. Brutal. But very true to life. And here's one for your old man! I really respect Flint's business acumen. Please, Sam, don't use the word acumen again. Guess he had it coming to him. I can't talk to that. Just love to turn this guy inside out. Ooh, that gives me an idea. According to these orders, something bizarre is happening at the carnival. I thought that was the whole point. Maybe we should check it out when we've got nothing better to do, like guinea time. I can't pick that up. I love this car. You're a sick puppy, Sam. 
No, really. I can't pick that up. It's a box of pecan flavored candies. It's a shelf full of Snuckies crap. I gotta go to the It's a shelf full of Snuckies crap. It's a box of pecan flavored candies. I gotta go to the bathroom. in charge here? Don't I wish. I'd have to go to Snucky U for another six years before I could run this place. But enough about me. What can I do for you? I'd like to buy this. Do you have any money? Of course I do. Here. Will that be all for you today? That'll be all. Anything else? My little buddy has to use the facilities. Facilities be damned! I need a bathroom! They're in the back. Here's the key. There's an awfully big rasp attached to that keychain. Out of toilet paper? Nah, we just had problems with thugs stealing our restroom keys. They're the cleanest in nine counties. The keys? The restrooms. You need some help, little buddy? I think I can handle this myself, Sam. Now, anything else I can do for you? Nothing. You have no idea how often I hear that. Never mind. Well, gotta return this key. Here's your key back. Are you in charge here? Don't I wish. I'd have to go to Snucky U for another six years before I could run this place. But enough about me, what can I do for you? Snucky U? What's that? I sense exposition, Sam. I'm glad you asked, mister. Snucky U is where all Snucky's employees are sent to learn the ins, the outs, the ups, the downs, the overs, and the unders of the amazing gastronomical and cultural phenomenon that is Snuckies. Fascinating. No, it's not. Humor him. At Snucky U, we're given intensive courses in patty pounding, choosing the right button for soft drinks, and the all-important pickle jar opening. I had no idea you were so rigorously trained. Hey, I can open any jar in the country. Cool. No, it's not. Now, how can I put all that Snucky U training to use for you? Are you sure Snucky U's not in the Bowl Coalition? Positive. Now, what can I do for you? Oh, I smell beef fritters. Beef fritters? We dip the cows right here in the kitchen. So, what do you want? Nothing. You have no idea how often I hear that. I can't use these things together. I don't think he'd want that. I don't think he'd want that.
Are you as confused as I am? More so. I'm excited. Who isn't? I'm thinking of a number between 1 and 10, and I don't know why. Me too. Well, that's all. Never mind. I thought I'd have something to say to you, but my mind's like a sieve. Don't worry about it. He's one hell of a soda jerk. Fountain. Genuine Native American drum, manufactured by genuine Native Koreans. Jackalopes, the bastard pets of Piltdown. It's a carousel of bootleg Sam and Max portable car bomb games. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. If Max spontaneously grew antlers, he still wouldn't be this ugly. Tom Nation and Blimey, he ain't here. So now what do we do? Now? Now we get in the bus and look for him, you idiot. I knew that. Huh? Get out of Mr. Bumpus way, ye partially clad barmaids. Who is that? I don't know, but if it weren't for the carefree innocence of this carnival, I'd be breaking his kneecaps. You're a demonic little imp, Max. Stop! I can't use these things together. Check this out, Jack. We're the freelance police. Here's our authorization to be here. Now let us in before we replace you with a cheap renewable fuel source. Let me run this by the boss. Uh, I guess you can go in. But be careful, cannibals can be dangerous to your health. Ho ho ho! That was needlessly cryptic. I'd be peeing my pants if I wore any. Everything seems to be in order here. Sam, look over there! How dare you call in the authorities without consulting me? Well, I tried talking to you, but you were off wallowing in your own self-pity. Yeah, but... It's them! Hi, I'm Shep Cushman, and this is my brother Burl. Welcome to our carnival. What's left of it? I'm Sam. He's Max. We savagely protect the rights of innocence. Even cruelly twisted ones such as yourself. Selves. Whatever. Well, you sound like just the guys to solve our little problem. Walk this way. Leave everything to us, and we'll have those abominations of nature back in your protective care before you can read the Koran. Didn't he fight Godzilla? Hi.
I won something. Excuse us. We need some help, and although you seem dangerously unequipped brain-wise, we've come to you for advice. Huh? Me and my partner want to ride the cone of tragedy. That's right. We've lost our will to live. I'm not supposed to, but what the heck? You two look like a couple of caring, non-litigious mammals. Strap yourselves in, and I'll turn on the cone. Ooh, I feel tragically empty. Me too. It's as though an integral part of my essence has been ripped from my being. Let's do it again. Maybe later, chum. Hey, what happened to my carefully collected box of useless junk? Will you help me? Depends. What do you want? Where'd all my cool junk go? It must have fallen out of your coat while you were on the ride. Here's a claim ticket. Take it to the lost and found. Holy cripes on toast! Nothing personal, but you're the single ugliest thing we've ever seen! Well, there was that computer game developers conference. Have you lost something? I've lost a whole bunch of neat junk. You must have been gifted with psychic powers to make up for your obvious physical shortcomings. Bad deal. Have you got a claim ticket? Sure! Wait here while I search through the back room. Well, here's all the stuff we've collected off the Kono tragedy today. It's all yours. 
I feel whole again. It's a powerful refrigerator magnet that says World of Fish on its side. I wonder how that got in there. It fits perfectly. 